like what kind of directions is that? Good afternoon, YouTube. Today is hump day. Mom and I are taking an adventure to Edmonton's accidental beach. Um, it's been all over the news, it's all over the paper, and I've never been, and obviously she has never been either, so we're going to find it today. If anyone has been there, comment down below what you think of it, but I'm so excited to see like what it looks like. I'm starting a later day today. It's also going to be 20 degrees out today, so it's beautiful. Got my shake my green smoothie. I hope you enjoy this vlog today. This vlog is going to be a little bit of everything of the activities that we are doing while my mom is here. Adventure times with Mama G! <laughs> She's trying to kill me. No. Yes. Okay, so if anyone wants to come to Accidental Beach never been, it says that you need to... <laughs> What kind of directions is that? I need GPS directions, not reading directions. Okay, so it said to use the second spot to get down to the river. And this is the second spot. It's literally just like an opening or whatever. So we're just gonna test it out so I don't have to drag my mother down here in the woods. This is what makes Edmonton different. And um, it's like those little hidden gems that we have. Okay, this is so pretty. I found an opening, but this is definitely not the way to the sandy part of the beach. But it's so pretty. Mom decided to join. I was just coming to check it out, but you're like, nope, let's do this. Yeah, it's like down there, because I see people down there, I just don't know how to get down there. Pexley, are we going to the beach? Oh geez, careful you. <laughs> This path like never ends. Yeah. Goes so far. Cute little birdhouse. Oh wait, there is a birdhouse to in the description of where we were going. So we obviously took the long way. We obviously. Okay, <laughs> good to know. Paxley, we found the beach. We found the beach. This is a cute little walkway. Do you need help down here? <laughs> I don't know if this is the actual entrance, but we're gonna take it. It's the coolest thing ever. Accidental Beach. So it's downtown Edmonton. And Accidental Beach. Like how cool it would be to live like over there. It'd be so close. But this is really neat. And the opening that we came down is like, I don't even know if that's the right one, but that's okay. And it has like a really neat view too. Like this is so cool. Okay, recommended place to come, besides the end of the world, which you saw in my last vlog, Accidental Beach. If you need directions or you're confused, I actually know where I'm going now, so I can help you a little bit more, but this is really neat. Pugsley, are you gonna go in the water? Wow, good job, buddies. That's probably as far as you'll go. Probably. <laughs> oh my goodness, your paws are gonna be all wet. They won't go in the water. Look at He's too afraid. Pugsley, come on! Let's go swimming! Let him chew on it first. Okay. <laughs> no, he's like, no. Stairs. Come on, let's go on the stairs. <laughs> he's like, nope. <laughs> come on, you. Okay, so after going there, taking the directions that we went, definitely went the long way. So I would recommend to actually park down 92nd Street because it's literally like right across the road and down the hill a little bit. So if you're wondering, 96th Street and 98th Ave go that way. Much, much easier. But it was a fun adventure and it's actually a really nice walking path if you do want to take the longer way. So that was really pretty. 
home now from the accidental beach. It was really cool. We I had to go to a doctor's appointment, so we didn't get to go there for that long, but at least we know where it is where it is now and a much easier way to get there. All super exciting is in the next clip. It will be Friday, the 29th of September. We are going to the Harlem Globetrotters game. I went there when I was like four. Out of all the people that they could have chosen the audience, they chose me to spin the ball on my finger. And I actually, to this day, still have the Globetrotters ball with, with all the signatures on it from the players. So I bought surprise tickets for my brother and my mom for us three to go do that together. I hope you enjoy the next clip. What's going on YouTube? To you guys, I never left. For me, it's been two days. Today is Friday, September 29th, which means today I'm taking my family to the Harlem Globetrotters. I'm so pumped. So with all that being said, please join myself and my family to the Harlem Globetrotters. Off to the Harlem Globetrotters. Oh. change of plans. My brother is not able to come with us because he's not feeling well. So, this guy's joining the family for the Harlem Globetrotters today. Nonetheless, I'm so pumped. I'm really excited. We're on our way to meet my mom there now. My brother's going to drop her off. So, Harlem Globetrotters, coming for you. Squirrel! Wave it to her. You wave to the wrong person at first. Do you know who your mom is? <laughs> what are you guys here for? Us too. <laughs> oh, That's funny. You, when I went home. you are now going to be on Cassandra's vlog. <laughs> <laughs> I went to the gymnastics club and you're coming. Okay. <laughs> okay, good. I just forget to ask you. No! Harlem Club. Everybody clap your hands! 
Shutters game. I hope you enjoyed this vlog today. Um, going to Accidental Beach with us and then going to the basketball game as well. It was so fun and so nice to bring my mom there. A little bit of a blast from the past. Honestly, the Globetrotters are just so talented, but they also send out a really good message. Um, just about, you know, if you believe in yourself and you tell your mind that you can do something, that you can achieve anything that you want as long as you believe in yourself. So it was a really cute message and they're really good role models. Um, it's so fun that they've been around for so long. But yeah, I, overall, I just really enjoyed it. It was so fun. It was so fun to go with my mom. And then at the end, getting my picture with Sweet Lou, which 
was just to think that it was so long ago and to see how far he's come. I definitely remember like me spinning that ball on my finger and being so young in my uh, purple Pocahontas sweatsuit. So it was really fun to like get a picture with him and meet him and kind of share with him my story about 22 years ago. So now closing out the vlog, I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up, share it, like it. Um, don't forget that I am giving a giveaway out fairly soon. Um, if you want more details on that, watch my social media because I am constantly posting it on there. Um, if you DM me if you have any questions and I will see you in the next one. Thanks.